chooses these little minuscule niches of history and without realizing them, you're, no one's done this in 150 or 60 years, so you're the one. So when someone comes in writing a book that covers something of local history, we really try to go to a, a, a really extraordinary effort to help because we know that's the one time it's going to be uh, recorded. So he's caused us to learn all kinds of uh, things about our rivers, and I became cognizant uh, of noticing things about the Withlacoochee when we were chasing other items. Uh, some of the best information came. Uh, we were needing to chase uh, 1912 for the sake of the college opening in January of 13, and people from Valdosta that were on a grand tour of Europe were on the Olympic, the sister ship to the Titanic, we were on the ocean at the same time when the Titanic sunk. And uh, the stories of them trying to, although they didn't get there, they made the attempt to get to the Titanic. So in reading all of this, we start running across uh, the Withlacoochee floods we hadn't heard of. We found several, and we started running across the listings of those floods, and one of the articles happened to mention uh, a very old timer, the early floods before they were recorded. So we were real thrilled run into that would have never known to take notice if you hadn't, hadn't come in the door. Uh, uh, Tom Baird is an educational consultant who has previously worked as a high school teacher, college instructor, oceanography and microbiology, director of the Science and Environmental Center, supervisor of science K-12 in Pasco County, Florida, director of science in Pinellas County, Florida, principal of a math, science, technology, magnet school, in Pinellas County, Florida, and a director of the National Science Foundation program. And also states he's on the boards of the Panhandle Archaeological Society at Tallahassee and St. Mark's River Refuge Association. He most enjoys exploring Florida and Georgia rivers by kayak and canoe. He is currently working on a book about the Wittacoochee River of South Georgia and North Florida. I will say we have failed in some of our attempts to collect information we've been told about or the person just hasn't produced it. And one I'm still waiting on is the fellow that told me that his uh, uh, uncle uh, had a still on the Withlacoochee River and he's got the photographs of the law coming and shooting up the still in his automobile. But he still has not produced the photographs. But uh, we're trying to hit every aspect with the Coochie uh, history while we're doing this. But it's been a pleasure to meet you. And, uh, he brought in his credentials uh, uh, sheet when he first came in. We might have charged the admission, but he did. <laughs> but it's been my pleasure meeting him. And on behalf of the community, uh, thank you for recording a portion of our history that's not compiled in the book. Thank you, Appreciate it. Appreciate it.